Now we're going to take a look at how you can manage the attendee list for your registration and ticket event. Um, in the events page, we're going to click on one of our registration events. Um, if you are using RSVPs to manage your attendees, um, I would refer you to that video in that area of our help center. Um, so we're going to click on the attendee list here and at the top. First of all, you can download name badges to um, a Microsoft Word file and it will load into an Avery template. Um, you can also export attendees here to another application, um, to a CSV file or to a PDF file. On the left hand side, you can um, manually filter by uh, whether um, it's been paid or payment not received or voided. Um, here at the top, you can view the attendees who have registered to date and view ticket breakdowns um, by ticket. You can also uh, view or download the uh, questions that attendees have answered to uh, custom questions that you've created. Um, so if I click on view for one of those um, tickets, I can view the custom question responses there and either download a PDF or a CSV file. And finally, if I have allowed attendees to upload files in the registration form, I can download those files collectively right there in a zip file. You can use this filter field right here to type in um, the first last name or uh, ticket number of uh, attendees. And to go into an attendee, you just simply find them and click on them. Here in this attendee overview area, you can download a ticket or you can click on the view order to view the entire order that that attendee was in. Click on the back button there. Um, you can also edit their personal information here. You can download any files that they had uploaded during registration and you can also edit the custom their responses to the custom questions right there um, for each attendee uh, for actually for the uh, columns here you can click on the up and down arrows to filter um, and you can use those to filter um, you can also click on the actions button next to the attendee to view it the attendee download a ticket or view the order in the waitlist area, if you have actually turned on waitlists for tickets that are sold out, you can view the totals right there of people who have signed up for the waitlist. You can manually add a new person to the waitlist right here. Um, you can download a CSV file of your waitlist. And then by, in the actions area, you can either edit or delete a person that's been added to the waitlist. That's how you manage the attendee list tool for registrations and tickets, but do let us know if you have additional questions.